hey y'all welcome back to my channel if you guys are new to my channel my name is baby scorpio or you guys can call me leah and in today's reading this is going to be the message of the week for june 4th through the 18th okay so i'm going to start off with the overall energy using the moon ology deck okay so let's see the overall energy for june 4th through the 18th let's see the overall energy for June 4th through the 18th. So I have the card, look at the bigger picture, okay? And it says full moon in Sagittarius. So Spirit is saying, do not think about how other people are trying to treat you. Make sure that you guys are looking at the bigger picture and focusing on what truly matters. Focusing on the end goal. Focusing on your plans. How you guys are going to move forward in your present moment. Spirit is saying, if you guys don't have any plans, make sure that you create plans so that you guys have the confidence to to move forward in your present moment um spirit is also saying that you guys are so close to achieving your goals so do not think about how other people want to destroy your plans or sabotage your plans make sure that you guys are focusing on how to level up how to focus on you spirit is saying take care of yourself and the universe will do the same for you so spirit is saying like make sure that you guys are grounding yourself make sure that you guys are practicing mindfulness make sure that you guys are drinking enough water uh that was something for me too so make sure that you guys are again focusing on leveling up okay um also make sure that you guys are grounding your energy so if anybody tries to like come at you in a certain way you guys are able to handle it without overly using your emotions when it comes to people wanting to sabotage you you guys have to think logically instead of like emotionally okay? we're just saying you guys don't want to be over emotional when you guys need to handle something logically okay and let's see how we should go about these weeks let's see how we should go about these weeks for june 4th through the 18th let's see how we should go about these weeks for june 4th through the 18th so I have the lover's card and the ace of pentacles. So spirit is saying align yourself with what you guys want. Make sure that you guys are setting your intentions. Also make sure that you guys are focusing on your end game. Like feel like you guys already have what you guys are trying to manifest. And then you guys will see your manifestation with the ace of pentacles. Okay. You guys are really close to receiving your manifestation. And spirit is saying make sure that you guys are again treating yourself. Make sure that you guys guys are um in this energy of feeling like you guys already have it okay feeling like you're not in this energy of lack okay because if you guys are in this energy of lack you guys are going to feel like you guys are dependent on your manifestation and you guys don't want to feel like you guys are dependent on your manifestation you guys want to feel like you guys already have it so let's see the issues that need to be handled so I have the card, the temperance card. So Spirit is saying, make sure that you guys are balancing out certain situations and aspects in your life. So it could be like um, your work and home life need to be balanced in order for you to bring in this manifestation. It could be like you guys need to have like a financial plan in order for you to bring in more money. So you guys are not spending the money frivolously when you guys manifest it. Okay. Spirit is saying, make sure that you guys invest your time, energy, and money into things that are going to help you stay in this balance okay spirit is saying if you guys are feeling out of balance with certain things it's because it's not in alignment with who you guys were meant to be okay or it's not in alignment with your purpose so if you're feeling unbalanced and you're feeling like oh uh, like oh uh, like this is not for me spirit is saying it's because it's not for you and i'm getting that um there's a difference between you feeling unbalanced and you feeling challenged okay spirit is saying like you guys are going to go through challenges but you guys have to look at those challenges in a different perspective um spirit is saying like when it comes to feeling like something is not for you like you know intuitively that something is not for you spirit is saying trust your gut and move forward in alignment with the lover's card okay move forward in alignment you're just saying align yourself with your core values if you guys don't know your core values that's something that needs to be worked on this week and let's see how we can grow this week let's see how we can grow this week 
Okay, I need a clarifier. Let's see how we can grow this week. And a clarifier for the three of swords in reverse. Okay, so you guys are healing from difficult situations from your past. You guys are healing from certain things that have uh, happened to you in the past. So uh, certain situations that have kept you in this mindset of feeling like you guys were not moving forward or you guys can't move forward. You guys are actually healing from that, okay? You guys are doing a lot of shadow work. Um, you guys are moving forward in situations that are gonna help you heal from negative emotions, okay? And with the Eight of Cups, Spirit is saying do some introspection so that you're able to heal yourself from these difficult emotions or these emotions of feeling like you guys are not worthy of your manifestation uh, again spirit is saying make sure that you guys are working on your core values okay Spirit is saying do some introspection on your core values and how you guys are emotionally taking care of yourself and with the nine of wands I'm getting that spirit is also saying make sure that you guys have healthy boundaries towards different people that are trying to be around you spirit is saying do not let everybody into your business do not let everybody into your life Spirit is saying you guys deserve that privacy and you guys also deserve a peace of mind so know that you guys deserve that and also take action towards that by setting healthy boundaries and seeing your core values so let's see some advice for this week and I'm using the power of love oracle deck so let's see okay so I have the card integrity it says you demonstrate the truth and honesty of your soul and manifest love with every action so spirit is saying you guys could be manifesting um, a partnership uh, and it could be like a business partnership or it could be uh, a romantic partnership or you guys could be um, deepening your partnerships so spirit is saying make sure that you guys are stepping into this energy of integrity so that you're able to take action genuinely so spirit is saying take genuine action towards the people places and environments that you guys want to be in okay spirit is saying don't do things just because other people want you guys to do it do it because you guys genuinely want to do it so that was the message of the week if this resonated with you make sure that you comment down below also make sure that you like share and subscribe to my channel and bye y'all